if you pay attention to other people, what they say and what they don't say can be pretty revealing with respect to their personality. For instance, I do not love food. And for that reason, I have never said such thing. But the thing is this, uh, I am this person which uh, do not like to be a burden for other people. And I would like them to think uh, that my life is better than what it actually is. But the thing is this, I am inside of my body. I am me. And for me, it is not that fucking obvious that uh, you have this huge fucking uh, appetite and love food. So then I'm not thinking that I should probably say that I love food in order to hide this. But the thing is this, I also have to be honest. And uh, even though I now understand that uh, we think uh, very differently, I still have to be honest. Also, I have to inform the world about my low appetite so that other people can consider other people like me but uh, then there is you you are this attention seeker and a psychopath which uh, like to present yourself as this uh, person with this problem with food but then you say that you love food which is a word which uh, I have never used because I don't. Having a problem with food and then saying that you love food is not two things which goes very good together, no. But you are inside of you and you do not understand that we think differently and you never will. You are never going to understand what it means to not love food. That is because you are stupid and you are incapable of understanding other people's way of thinking. Therefore, you do not understand that you should not say that uh, you love food in order to hide that you do not have this eating disorder. But... Uh, since I have made this video now, you're going to stop saying it, but you don't understand why. However, me having a low appetite is not the same as struggling with food, but things are connected. And we are far better off uh, by thinking that uh, no one has an eating disorder because you know what? This is my genetics, you cannot change that. And uh, these other psychopaths pretending to have an eating disorder, they abuse people like fucking hell by uh, having this eating disorder. So yeah, remove the eating disorders, please. And uh, some of my eating problems uh, could have been... Uh, removed but uh, a lot of it is pure genetics and uh, these uh, people that is uh, supposed to help you with this eating disorder is only there to abuse you so they are not going to make this any better anyway so remove the eating disorders and when i am saying that some of my problems with food could have been removed i am talking about my history now I just have a fucking low appetite. Or I also have a low confidence, but as I said, a lot of it is pure genetics. And my confidence is just that.